General Dynamics Land Systems is teasing a next-generation Abrams main battle tank, the original variant of which entered U.S. military service in 1981. Details about this new version's capabilities are very limited at present, but there are clear indications that it will feature a slate of improved weapons, sensors, and other equipment over existing M1 tanks, including the possibility of some form of hybrid conventional electric propulsion system. Hot on the heels of Rainmetal's unveiling of their new KF-51 Panther tank, General Dynamics Land Systems released a teaser for its next-generation Abrams main battle tank. GDLS, the manufacturer of the M1 Abrams, also teased other next-generation vehicles on a dedicated website. The Abrams Next Gen, as GDLS calls it on the site, comes with very few details. Aside from a shadowy image and a mysterious teaser video, GDLS advertises the tank as Legend Mode. The next generation of dominance. GDLS also notes that the Abrams Next Gen and the rest of its next generation battlefield technology will be revealed at the Association of the United States Army Convention in Washington, D.C. on October 10, 2022. A dedicated website for the next generation Abrams is now online. This same website teases a slate of other next-generation designs from General Dynamics Land Systems GDLS, including a new base configuration for the company's Stryker 8x8-wheeled armored vehicle and another planned variant in that family equipped with the Leonidas high-power microwave-directed energy weapon, the latter of which you can read more about here. Various unmanned ground vehicle offerings from GLDS, including a variant of the TRX track design armed with dozens of loitering munitions, which is now called Razorback, and the company entry into the U.S. Army's Small Multipurpose Equipment Transport Program, are featured on the site as well. Beyond various taglines, such as Legend Mode and the Next Generation of Dominance, there are essentially no specific details about exactly what this new Abrams configuration entails. Other separate GLDS promotional material shows that this design is almost certainly unrelated to the upgraded M1A2 system enhanced package version 4, SAPV4, variant now under development for the U.S. Army. One detail that can be inferred about the Abrams Next Gen is a drivetrain upgrade. In the description of GDLS YouTube teaser video for the tank, the company states, silent strike, they'll never hear us coming. With increased demand from the military and Congress for hybrid electric vehicles, it's possible that GDLS plans to evolve the Abrams with a hybrid drive. After all, defense manufacturer Oshkosh created a hybrid silent drive version of its light combat tactical all-terrain vehicle which already won the joint light tactical vehicle competition. In addition to the Abrams Next Gen, GDLS also teased the Striker Next Gen with the tagline, the Striker just got meaner. Another platform that was a teased is the Leonidas, a variant of the Striker designed to counter UAVs. GDLS teased the Leonidas with the lines, Drone Killer.